Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, Hum by Verizon, RockAuto.com, State Farm, and WeatherTech. The event where you can do more than just park your car. Impact is where you can literally do it all. Held at Pocono Raceway in Long Pond, Pennsylvania, it's one for the books. While it's mainly a German gathering, more specifically the M division of BMW, other brands are welcome. I came from Charlotte, North Carolina, drove the car up, took me about nine hours yesterday. It's an amazing, amazing day. Vinny was supposed to meet a buddy until he ran into car trouble. No worries though, with an Audi R8 V10 supercharged, you're bound to meet new ones. Got a new, new friend riding along. Yeah, his dad just said, hey, can you go ride with you? He said, sure, let's go. High performance driver's education, 2300 foot side-by-side -side racing, a drift taxi, burnout contest, a judged car show, and plenty of vendors. Perhaps the best part, seeing cars which once had not even 200 horsepower beat cars 10 times their retail price. Cars in 1987, 325 convertible, sketchy. Um, it's got a S52 motor in it from a 98 M3. It's built, big turbo. Um, buddy Derek tunes it, it works, it goes. This is the perfect atmosphere for this group to test and tune the 800 plus horsepower BMW. It's fun, it's no, it's no animosity, it's a lot of fun, like racing people, um, no one judges anybody, it's fun. That same chassis also shares the bones of a legend. In the mid 1980s, BMW decided that they need a serious competitor for both the road and the track. They took the E30 chassis and made the first of the M3 line. A stiff chassis and direct steering made for a fierce track car. To this day, it has over 1,500 victories and is unbeaten as a touring car. While it came with a 2.3 liter four cylinder, many later opted for the next M motor out of the E36. In line after that is the E46 body. That's followed by the only M3 to ever have a V8, the E92. And most recently, the F80 M3, which is labeled as M4, but we won't get into that. So somehow, I convinced Jason to let me drive his car. Much Tough. appreciated, my friend. This thing has 500 horsepower, 93 octane, and 670 on 105 octane. Woo! My first turbo E46. This car is the last of the raw feeling M3s before electronics began taking over. Jason's doubled up on the fast. Maximum PSI turbo kit with a precision 6266 turbo means power delivery like a kick to the face. There we go. Taking it easy in first. Get us in the second. Oh, buddy, when that turbo kicks in. Yeah, the good, good boost. <laughs> oh, my goodness, at the top end, this thing is an absolute beast. Whether you want to hard park or get out there and make some noise, Combine all this together and you have a car show that makes an impact like no other.